Ah, tô bom, é bom, Ah, tô bom, é bom. Hi everyone, I'm Robert and in this video I'm going to talk about both Madagascar games on the GBA. Madagascar is a pretty okay game. Many reviewers call it a cookie cutter game. For me it was okay, but yes, it is indeed pretty much standard stuff. It's the usual platformer, and even if characters have different abilities, the game still feels repetitive. Yet, it's decent. As characters you get Alex the Lion that can double jump and knock out enemies, Marty the Zebra that can run fast, crawl, hide in crates and kick short enemies, Melmon the Giraffe that can dig and bury his head in the ground while enemies walk by, Skipper the Penguin that can also crawl and hide inside of crates, and Gloria that can squash enemies and spikes and can also swim. All of the game's 13 levels, even if you constantly get something new because of each character, still, the game manages to give you the feeling that it's all the same. As for difficulty, the game is super easy, as it's clearly targeted towards kids. The graphics and music are awful, but even if the game got bad reviews, I consider it decent to mediocre, as it's ugly and can feel repetitive. Madagascar Operation Penguin is amazing. You play the game as Skipper, and the game feels like a sequel to the first game, but with a clear emphasis on the penguins. So even if most of the game you play as Skipper, there are also some levels where you play as Alex and Marty. The story is the one from the movie, but told from the perspective of the penguins. As for the gameplay, the premise is to get to the end of a level without being suspicious. So when you see a human, you smile and wave. And when he's not looking, you either karate chop the guy or slam a fish in his face. And this mechanic works surprisingly good. There were some places where the level design was annoying and you wouldn't see the guy coming because he wasn't in the camera, but for the most part, the checkpoint system and level designs were good except for the parts with Alex and Marty. Alex doesn't control that well and Marty has to hide in big crates to hide, he can't just smile and wave. Also Skipper has a glider, a standard blower near fruit baskets, he can use his slingshot, he can swim and can toboggan. And the toboggan levels are pretty nice. You have momentum and can speed through the level while sliding, overall the game is great, it's creative, it brings new gameplay mechanics that are also executed very well, and the game is engaging. A clear recommendation.